Hi, Capel. You look terrible. Shouldn't you try and get some rest? I can't. I feel really tired, but... Hmm. Are you sure you don't want to fight with us? You really dislike fighting? Yeah, it's dangerous. I'd rather just be playing tunes on my flute. But... But you fought to protect me! I don't like getting hurt. Don't you find it foolish? Are you saying we're foolish? That's not what I meant. I, I, I was just trying to say... You just said that we're fools for getting hurt while fighting for others, didn't you? Sorry, I made a mistake. I don't think it's foolish to fight for others. Your attitude's terrible, Capel. I told you, a cowardly fool is of no use to us. Uh, and you are? Edward. You see? He isn't like us. He doesn't understand why we fight. He's more concerned about himself than with honor. Uh. Oh, thank you for saving Aya. But that's all. She got into trouble for helping you. So, that means we're even now. Sorry. Just go away, Capel. Hey! Aya? <sighs> Aya! Don't touch me! This is nothing. I can handle it. I'm not going to... Aya! You're still suffering from that wound? <sighs> It's... it's just an old one. Then why? We protect our lord with our life. No more reason is needed. Why now? There's nothing to worry about. I will protect Lord Sigmund. I'll go and find Sigmund. No, you fool! She's... Hey, how is she? I dressed and cleaned her wound, but it's not healed. Not healed? But the bleeding stopped. How is this possible? This isn't a normal wound. It's unrealistic for us to keep treating her. Her body can't take it anymore. It's a wonder she could still walk today. What then? The problem is this is a lunaglyph curse. There's nothing we can do for her here. Then we bring her somewhere else. Mm. What's wrong with that? Our mission is to break the Azure Chain. And? The people can't go on like this. We cannot delay destroying the chain any longer. 
So you're just gonna let her die? Uh, she's one of us! That's why we have to leave her. Aya will regret it if she becomes a burden. That's why we have to go and destroy the chain. It's for her sake, too. Ed is right. This is the manner in which things must happen. There is a village nearby, Nolan. Yes, as I recall, the village has a deep tie to the Claridian of Burgas. Good. Aya will be taken there for proper treatment. But we can't put off destroying that chain any longer. Capel, I want you to carry out this task. What? Sigmund? Uh, me? Wait, my lord! We cannot trust this boy! Ed. I'll do it, my lord. I'll drop Aya off at Nolan and return to your side immediately. And what about the chain? <sighs> I trust you, Capel, and leave Aya in your care. This coward will never do it! We can't trust him! You won't let me down, will you? <sighs> no. I'll go. I'll take her to Nolan. What? I'm sorry. Our leader is like this all the time. Please, help her. Yes. Take this sword with you. Oh, I don't need a sword. It was given to me by the King of Burgas. It bears the royal emblem on its hilt and will grant you safe passage. But... I will entrust you with it. Whether you unsheathe it or not is up to you. Well, if you insist... Take care of Aya. I will.
didn't ask for this. Oh, here we go again. Maybe he's a vegetarian. No turning back now. Looks like we're here. This place is a mess. Stop right there! Stick him up! I'm Rico! I'm Richa! I'm the top beastmaster here! I am a summoner! No bandits allowed! You better give up now! Uh, yeah. Well, we're just looking for somewhere to rest. Oh, right over. Ow! Why did you do that? Rucha? He's a bandit! He... he is? Hey, kids. Busy right now. She's six, but I really need a place to take care of her. She... she's sick? Yes, and she needs a place to rest. No, she doesn't. How can I make them understand?
just tell me where she can lie down? Oh, sure. Phew, thank you. I also need to meet with the Claridian priest, if possible. He's gone. We haven't heard anything. What's wrong? Is he missing or something? Why don't you come to our house first? You two can rest there. Thank you.